Namaste. My name is Lipi Mahendra. I am a student of Shri Jagdish Janathanan sir. I have been learning Rangam from the past one and a half years under his guidance. Today, I shall be speaking about the parts of our Rangam and Rudangam basics. A Rudangam is an Indian percussion instrument widely used as the rhythmic accompaniment in Carnatic music and dance. A Rudangam is usually made out of the trunk of a jackfruit tree. The trunk is cut to the right size, hollowed out and shaped outside to get the required shape of a Rudangam. The ends are then covered with animal skin. Amritagam has 16 holes or eyes on each side. A nylon rope or leather straps are laced through these holes, keeping the two skins in place. The ropes can be tightened according to the tension required. The middle part of the Amritagam is called the stomach. The smaller side on the right of the Mridangam is called Valantale. The ring of skin on the top is called Male Mutu and the layer of skin beneath it is called Kirtate. In the center, a mixture of rice paste and iron powder is applied. This side gives the high pitch sound. The wider side, which is on the left, is called Yadantane. The ring of skin on the top is called Mutu. It is made up of two layers of skin. Beneath it lies another layer of skin called Thol. This here is the gum which helps in producing the bass sounds. Some people use semolina paste instead of gum. Now let's get on to the basics of Nidangam. If you are a right handed person, the Mridangam should be kept on your right leg. It should be kept right above the ankle but below the knee. A clock can also be kept on your leg for comfort. Now, the first lesson which usually everyone learns is Tap Dit Tom Nam. Now, this exercise is usually done in 3 or 4 speeds. 